But the bottom line is we're going to have to be prepared for hail and wind. That's the most likely severe threat out of this tomorrow. Scattered storms are going to hold off until that late afternoon and into the evening hours. But of course, that's bad timing because this could impact a lot of outdoor plans, a lot going on, including the big pregame pre rally out at the Enterprise Center. In fact, News 4's Kim St. Ange has been looking into what the backup plan is for all the fans. This is such a big weekend for St. Louis here. So important, a lot going on. Keep in mind, between the Cardinals game down the street at Bush Stadium and then, of course, the watch party for the Blues right here on this two-block stretch of Market Street, we're talking about tens of thousands of people expected downtown tomorrow. And as you just heard Steve saying, he's forecasting this storm to hit this area north of the Enterprise Center about an hour before that game is going on. So we're asking people today, okay, does that change the plans for this? This big event where all these people are going to be outside. So look at this. The Enterprise Center tells us as of now, the party is still going on. And if anything changes, the Blues or the NHL will make the announcement. So we called the NHL. A spokesperson says as of this afternoon, there was no backup plan, adding it will actually take direction from the city and directed us to call the city. So we reached out to the city, which says the Blues are organizing the watch party and is not sure offhand what the rain plan is. Really today, with all these different calls we made, it seemed to be a lot of passing the buck. You know, the other question we really wanted to know in all of this is, okay, so let's just say all these people are out here, it starts raining. Are there any sort of uh, shelters that people can go in to take cover? And at this point, at this hour, we are still waiting to hear back, but I can tell you we're going to keep pushing to get answers on that. We also talked to the St. Louis City Police Chief about security for this event. Take a listen. We have a, a detail that's planned. Um, it, it, it includes uh, members of the Highway Patrol as well as St. Louis County, and so our own detail. And so we're going to have plenty of officer visibility and presence, and we're looking forward to a good time. And talking about a good time, even the mayor herself is tweeting about this. Lida Cruson tweeting today, whether you're watching the St. Louis Blues or the Cardinals, downtown St. Louis is the place to be this weekend. Certainly tens of thousands, like I mentioned, expected to be here. Doors for this event open at 3 o'clock. Best part is it's free, so that is great. Uh, we have some band, Echo Smith, the indie band that's playing on the stage here behind me at 530. Keep in mind, you cannot bring an umbrella. You can bring a poncho, but umbrellas are not allowed allowed here. You can find all the information about this event. Just head over to our News 4 app. Live downtown, Kim St. Ange, News 4.